guys, welcome to Grayson's two and a half year update. Say hi, Gray. Say hi. Can you wave to the camera? Say hi. Say I'm two and a half years old. <laughs> He's like so confused. So I thought I'd just record a little update on Grayson at two and a half and all the things that he's done. I haven't done one since he was two and I feel like he is a world different. He's just so much bigger. Um, so the biggest thing with Grayson that has changed is he is talking and he is talking like crazy. He sings all the time. He loves songs. He has memorized several books and can recite them by memory. He can't really read yet but he can memorize books. He has memorized Sheep in a Jeep. He has memorized um, all of his alphabet books. He knows, I mean, he knows the alphabet. He knows numbers. He can count up to 30, and then he can count 40, 50, 60, and so on, up to 100. He has Little Blue Truck memorized. He has Goodnight Goon memorized. Um, he has these um, alpha blocks memorized. There's a City Build a Block book that he has memorized, and it has all the different trucks, and he has all the truck name memorized. There's a farm block that he has memorized as well, and it goes over all the farm animals. So he is very, very smart. He can memorize lots of books. It's amazing to see. He also has a lot of like YouTube videos memorized, like there'll be dialogue between characters and he has that memorized. So he's very, very smart. I think he's going to be like a doctor or something because he can just memorize things so easily. You can hear him. He's just, he's playing with puzzles in the background. He didn't really want to be on my video and he's moving my camera. Grayson loves puzzles. He's getting, um, I mean, he can do like the number puzzle, like I'll insert here. Four. So, um, you can just see, like, there's puzzle pieces there. He's starting to get into that now, which is really exciting to see. Grayson loves Paw Patrol on Nickelodeon. He has the theme song memorized and a lot of the characters he knows the names of. Um, he also loves Puppy Dog Pals. I'd say that's his favorite TV show right now. That's on um, Disney Junior. He also loves Little Baby Bum on Netflix. He still loves that. Even though I thought he would get over it, he loves that show. 
on YouTube. He loves super simple songs and Coco Melon. I've tried to get him into Blippi, but he's just not that into it yet. Another thing I've tried to get him into is watching a movie. Like, he has yet to watch a whole movie. I've put on Moana. I've put on different Disney movies. He's just so active. He does not like sitting still. That's another thing, Grayson. He is always active, always moving, running around tumbling off the couch. I need to put him back into gymnastics class because he has so much energy. Grayson loves swinging on the swing. He loves sidewalk chalk. Loves sidewalk chalk. He loves coloring um, as well inside, but sidewalk chalk is definitely his favorite. His favorite song right now, I would say it's either um, this counting song um, that goes through the numbers one through 10. He's also obsessed with Jack and Jill makes me sing it over and over and over again. Um, he's super into holidays, so Halloween and Christmas are his favorite. Yeah, he makes me sing all the Christmas songs over and over and over, no matter what time of year it is. And he also loves Halloween. He loves anything spooky. Um, he is starting to catch on that things are scary, though. We took him to the Spirit Halloween store, and there was a little animatronic that jumped out at him and he got very scared so he is starting to get like scared of things but nothing like scared of the dark or anything like that but he loves looking at ghosts and skeletons and loves all of that he still is obsessed with the baby shark loves the baby shark loves all of that he even has a baby shark puzzle that he loves playing with Grayson loves pancakes he loves spaghetti and um, I mean really anything with noodles. He loves donuts, he loves candy, <laughs> he loves apples, loves apples, could have one a day. I mean he loves apples, loves bananas, loves raspberries and strawberries as well. Um, he's really a fruit guy. Not so much a vegetable guy, but loves fruit. Does not like trying new things. We have to really um, bribe him to do that. And so he does not like to branch out, but I think that's just a kid thing. Gray loves repetition and he requires you to repeat everything he says and he will just keep repeating it and repeating it and repeating it until you repeat after him. That's kind of something unique to him. So like he keeps repeating Jack and Joe because he wants me to sing the song Jack and Joe. But even if he's just saying anything like, hey look at that, like he wants me to say, hey look at that. He will keep repeating it until I repeat it after him. So that's kind of unique to him. He's also very like particular, almost like OCD. He has to have everything in its proper spot. If like that number puzzle, if I had a piece that was slightly off and not in its place securely, he would freak out and fix it and would not let it just stay like sideways. Also, like we have a door to our basement and if it's open at any point, he has to close it, like it has to be closed. So it's like little things like that that he has to have like perfectly in place. Um, which I, I myself was like that when I was little, so that's a little something of me that has got into him. He still has blonde hair, still has blue eyes. He, I don't know how much he weighs, but he's getting really tall. He can now reach the light switches on our walls, which is like blows my mind that he's that big. He loves bath time. He could spend a half hour in the bath. He just loves it so much. I'm going to be signing him up for preschool soon um, in January, and then he will be attending in the fall, which just blows my mind that he's going to start preschool soon. He's going to be in school. He is definitely ready, though. Um, the only thing he's not ready with preschool is potty training. So I tried potty training him for a month, a solid month I tried. I gave it my best shot and he just was not ready. Um, I definitely want to get him done by the time he turns three though, because I've heard if you wait until after three, they get a lot more independent and not as willing to work with you. So I'm hoping that by the next update, by his three year update, he will be potty trained. Wish me luck, because he just has no interest in it as of right now. Grayson is such a great boy. He's such a great sleeper. He sleeps like two, two and a half, three hour naps, and then he sleeps through the night. 
I put him down at 7.30. He wakes up at around 7 a.m. the next day. He doesn't... Water, yes. He doesn't fight me on going to bed. He loves reading a bedtime story at night. Um, we used to put books in his bed because he loves reading books, but he is actually having a really bad tearing problem right now, and if you leave him alone with any book, he will tear it to shreds and does not care. Um, we've put him in time out, we've disciplined him, but you know, he just doesn't care. Um, along with the disciplining thing, he's definitely in those terrible twos. He's definitely testing boundaries, seeing what he can get away with with Anthony and I. Um, his younger brother, we've seen him kind of hit before, um, or he does things after we tell him not to. So he's just kind of seeing what he can get away with, pushing those boundaries. So definitely the terrible twos, but for, for the most part, he's actually a really happy guy. Um, he does have whining fits here and there, but uh, for the most part, he's pretty, pretty happy. I, we got really lucky with him. He's just such a great little boy, and I love spending time with him. Grayson loves animals, um, loves animal sounds, loves looking at animals. Um, Berkeley, my parents' dog, is his favorite dog. He just loves her. Unfortunately, my sister's dog, Dakota, is probably his least favorite dog, <laughs> only because she knocks him over because she's a puppy and she's just really excited to see him. So hopefully that changes as as she gets bigger and as Grayson gets bigger as well. Grayson is a big brother now, that's a change. Um, he, like I said, he doesn't really care for his little brother. He kind of leaves him alone for the most part, or he does interact with him, he's kind of a rough with him. So we're working on that, but I'm excited to see them interact as Porter gets bigger. Grayson's really not into like imaginative play or anything like that. He doesn't really have any favorites, no favorite color or any like favorite animal. Like he doesn't really understand that concept yet. Like I said, he doesn't really like have imaginary friends or if we have like a pirate ship or like a train, he doesn't like imaginary play with that. He just is more into like building things. He is into Legos. Like we have these um, Duplo like mega blocks that he has started to get into and he mostly likes tearing it apart, but he will. Um, build it here and there. <laughs> He's like looking at the viewfinder like, what's going on? <laughs> He's a curious little boy. He loves getting into everything. Um, he loves watching his daddy play video games, which he thinks is pretty fun. No, don't touch, don't touch the camera. <laughs> He's a stinker. As you can see, those terrible twos, he, uh, likes to see what he can get away with. We are in Grayson's room right now, if you can't tell. We're just hanging out, playing with his toys. He's awesome in the car. He's always awesome, been awesome in the car. He just sits there. It's been a lot easier now that I've turned around his seat, and so he's looking forward instead of looking back, and he really enjoys that. He loves looking at all the cars and the trucks. He's super into trucks, super into the mailman. Um, we try to hit the mailman every morning and see him, and he loves watching him come around. He also loves trucks. Um, like I said, he has like all these different trucks, excavator and sky cranes. He's got like all these things memorized and loves trucks. That's why his two-year-old birthday party was a construction truck theme birthday party because he loves trucks. He is a little shy guy. Um, if he knows people, like he'll run right up to them. But he's a little shy when he meets new people for the first time, which is definitely me. I'm a little shy here and there. As you can hear, he's singing. <laughs> he's singing Hey Diddle Diddle, loves that song. Loves I nursery like rhymes, loves songs. I like this But I think that's kind of it about Grayson being two and a half. Um, I'll give another update when he's three years old, but I just want to kind of document where he is right now. He's so smart. He learns a new thing every day, I swear. He's a little parrot. He loves repeating everything that we say, and he loves when we repeat what he says. So I can't wait to see where he is at three years old. So thanks for watching. Can you say bye, Gray? Grayson. Say bye! Can you wave? Say bye! We'll see you guys later. Bye!